So the first type of skill you're going to need to know is how to write RPN for an expression. So we're given an expression like variables. And each variable, so we've got one, two, three, four, is called an operand. So P is an operand, Q is an operand, R is an operand, and S is an operand. Really simple so far. Then we've got, let me use a different colour, operators, where we've got a plus sign, a minus sign, and a divide sign. And we've got three operators. So, what we need to be aware of is that there's a template where you have an operand followed by another operand followed by an operator. I'm going to do O-P-E for operator when we're using RPN. So, if we're going to write this out as an expression, we would have our first operand, which is P, followed by Q. So that is operand followed by an operand. Now we want an operator, so I'm going to do O, P, E, and our operator is a plus sign. So we've done this so far. We now have our next operand, which is R. So we've just done that. We then have S. And in this scenario, we've got two operators. We've got the divide sign, which is separating R and S. And then we've got the minus sign. And that is, oops, let's do these in blue. the expression RPN for this. So if I just undo everything, we should have PQ plus R S divide, which is this one, and then the negative which joins them both together. Now, this works the same. Now, if we're using big mass, it doesn't matter which one we do because they're both in brackets. So let's do this one first. We've got, see if you can do this one, pause the video and see if you can do this one yourself. Okay, here's a solution. You've got uh, operand A, B, plus. So we've done one, two, and then the operator. Now I'm going to do C and D. So we're going to do C, D. Whoa, that's a really bad D. I'm going to sharpen that out. So D. Folks, that's a D. Then we've got a minus, which are joining them both together. These two operands is joined by a negative. Then we've got a multiply so that's a negative, and then that's a multiply. <coughs> now this third one is going to be very, very similar again. Remember, you've got to pair them up. So, pause the video, see if you can do it yourself first. So let's do it backwards. Let's do the bracket first, so we're going to do C and D, and the operator which joins them is a negative. So that's 1 and 2. Now if we do the other end, we've got this operand here. We'll call it 3, and it's got this operator here. Now this operator belongs to this operand, so we need to 
use reverse Polish notation, so it's going to be A minus. So we simply take the negative minus sign and move it to the other side of the operand. That leaves us with our connection to B. Now we simply then do B and we put in our divide. So we simply put this to the other side of B. That leaves us with multiply by 4. So we put the 4 in as our operand and then we move this to become RPN there. Which leaves us with this divide. Now we've got CD together, we did that at the beginning. So we can simply just move this to the end. And there we go. So we've just created an expression, RPN expression, or a statement, should I say, from this expression.